for Construction Pros from Con Expo 2017 right here at the Las Vegas Convention Center. And with me is John Dotto, who is a brand marketing manager with Case Construction Equipment. Welcome aboard. Thanks for having me. Well, you're more than welcome. You're taking time out of a very busy schedule. It, it's a busy day. It's a busy day. And it's busier because you have a super secret piece of equipment. Well, the uh, the, the cat's out of the bag uh, <laughs> now, but uh, yeah, we, we brought a, a concept. No, vehicle. no, no. It's the case is out of the bag right the now. Case, the case is out of the bag. Good catch. Good catch. Um, yeah, we, we brought a concept vehicle here to Con okay. Expo that would create essentially a new product category. Um, we've got contractors using large CTLs in earth moving applications uh, as small dozers. But what you, what you lose when you put a blade on the front of a CTL in a traditional style right. is some of the, the, the true great ability and pushing power because you're not connected through the frame of the machine, you're hooked up to the loader arms. So what did you have to do to this DL450 to achieve this product? Yeah, so what we did was we, we tasked the engineers with uh, with just that. Find a, find a way to cross over between a small dozer and a large CTL. What they did is they built a large, heavy uh, C-frame assembly that then connects that dozer blade directly to the machine frame itself. So the power goes into the machine frame and that's where it exerts the most pressure. Yeah, all of that, that horizontal force from right. pushing is now transferred through the frame of the machine in a much more efficient way. Um, and then what you get in that is uh, now we're looking at, that machine has dozer style control sticks in it, really? not CTL style. Um, so you get the full six way functionality of that dozer blade. You can put a bigger blade on it um, because it's just a, it's a, a better, more efficient package. And when you're not dozing, you can drop that whole system and go ahead and pick up any of your other CTL attachments that you own and run it just like a traditional CTL. So it's got the, the trimmable sticks and everything yes, in sir. it? Yes, sir. Yeah. We're operating both sides. Yeah, and it's got a, a Leica Geosystems 3D grade control system on it. Um, so you're, you're really taking care of business uh, on, on that machine. Power steering, backup camera, you got it's it. It's got the whole Lane works. departure. It's got, it's got the works, it's got the works. It'll parallel park for you. Okay, that's what, <laughs> that's what I'm talking about. Yeah. So, what did you have to do, I, or, or, let me ask you this question this way, what's your customer response so far? So far, it, it's, it's been great. I, I think there's, I think there's a, a, a big part of the small excavation business market um, that's been doing a lot of dirt work with CTLs, but now they're, you know, in all, in all equipment, we're looking for more and better ways to be more efficient, more productive, and more multifunctional with a single piece of gear. So what this will let you do is, is have that small dozer and that CTL in one machine. Was customer response and input, was that basically what got you to say, let's look at this concept more closely? Yeah, so customer response and input was what got the project kicked off. And what we're doing here at Con Expo this week is we're having focus groups in our booth. Uh, we're inviting contractors to come talk with us about what they see here. Uh, and tell us if we're headed in the right direction. So when we go to the next phase of development for this project, okay. we know that we've got customer input and that's what CASE is all about, is, is making sure that we're not just building and designing in a bubble, but we're actually creating a machine uh, that, that, that our customers are looking for. Well, I know you're in the North Hall because we're neighbors. You're right next door to where our booth is yes, located. Sir. Yes, sir. And it's huge. This is a huge booth. How many pieces of equipment just offhand do you have offhand, in this Offhand, there's, there's got to be about 60 pieces of equipment I in that booth. I would say it's, it's just immense. It's about the size of a football field, just not the same shape. Well, it sure is. No question about there's it. A, there's a lot to see. Be, be, and besides. I'm sure that the apex of this thing is your new DL450. The, the DL450 is, is, a, is a big part of that booth. There's a lot of other exciting things happening right. in the booth uh, on the excavator side, the compaction side, the wheel right. loader side of things. Uh, we've got an exciting skid steer loader uh, special edition over there in the case booth as well. But uh, certainly that, that the concept crossover vehicle is not just a, an exciting part of our booth this year, but we think it's an exciting exciting niche in the market uh, where we're going with this, this CDL, a compact dozer loader. One machine doing two things better than one can. Well, that's what I'm saying, yeah. and, and, and you've, you've said it well, because it is definitely a true piece of crossover equipment. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. John Dotto, 
who is the uh, product marketing manager with Case. This your little baby, huh? Yes, sir. You're going to take care of it now. Yes, sir. <laughs> Absolutely. Pleasure to meet you. Thanks for coming over and sharing your story. Thanks, Roger. From Con Expo 17. Thank <laughs> you.